I'm right here at the athletes meeting, I'm standing next to two time first runner up, two time Arnold Classic champion, the Predator Kai Green. Kai, my question for me to you. How bad do you want to win a show that we, after getting second two years in a row? How bad does Kai Green want it this year? And what Kai Green can we expect to get on stage Friday night? Well, I think Kai Green. I think Kai Green. I think Kai Green really, really wants to seal the deal. Um, I think he's worked very, very hard. Not only, not only have I worked very hard, but. I have a team that's been uh, been very, very fortunate to have working with me uh, for this part of the journey. Um, Got to give a shout out to Muscle Meds, uh, Pinnacle, Flex Magazine, um, and the people that are at home that are just showing so much love and support. It is absolutely ridiculous. Um, I, am, I, am, I am honored, I am warmed, I am encouraged, and I'm inspired. So to answer your question, yeah, man, we won it pretty damn bad. I always say, you know, a lot of people say this guy is the hardest working man in bodybuilding or this guy or that guy. And I personally say Kai Green, in my eyes, is the hardest working man in bodybuilding simply because I've seen things, I've seen you do things that others won't do. And that is cardio and off season when everybody else goes to bed. Kai's looking for a treadmill. I've seen you do a, I don't know, several hour photo shoot last year the day after the Olympia, and you still got on the step mill after the photo shoot. So to me, that tells me you started preparing the day after the show last year. Is that right? Yeah, we, we really did. We, we, we got right back on the horse, um, got started. Even when we still had to do a lot of the traveling and everything, um, we just uh, tried to stay ahead of schedule the whole way through. Um, I was very, very fortunate to have uh, you know, the people that I have in my life supporting me behind the scenes. Got to give a shout out to George Farah. That's my boy. And he definitely um, has, has really been uh, he's really been the mastermind of this campaign going forward. And um, so, you know, just with all due respect, I just, you know, I'm just very thankful, very appreciative for the support that I've had. And man, when you talk about the people, the supporters, out there now, I mean, man, it's it's, it's pretty amazing. It's, it's very, very amazing. Your fan base must must be the biggest fan base of any of the active pros at this point in time. And what I see is that you do a lot for the fans. You do your videos, you do your little movies, you know, and this is giving back to the fans. And I think you deserve every fan that you have. And what, um, let me put it this, this way. I hear, a lot of times I hear Kai Green has the body, but when he's on stage, he seemed to be sometimes a little bit like you hold him back. Like, for instance, when people say you and you, they called you and Phil, Phil stepped forward to gain a couple of pounds in size, you stood back. You did not step forward. What Kai are we going to expect this year? Is Kai going to, you going to fight for this title? You going to step with him or you just going to stand there and do your thing? Well, you know, I definitely want to respect, you know, where we are and being on stage and play nicely and fair. But there ain't gonna be none of that this year. <laughs> <laughs> no more Mr. Nice Guy. We, we, you know, we, we definitely wanna make sure that the, the audience gets what they paid to see. You know, we wanna make sure that we represent ourselves as best we can as athletes, as, as, as professionals, you know. And, you know, if, if, if you gotta mix it up a little bit, you know, if you got to put your foot in somebody back just a little bit, then we're prepared to do that too. But um, more importantly, we want to be here for the fans this weekend as well as just working to see, you know, some things happen that I've been working for for a long time. Well, you heard it here first. Kai means serious business. He looks like he means serious business. And I'm not going to hold you on for too long because I know last minute preparation are intact right now. So, for the predator, Kai Green. Well, we can't sum it up just yet. I just also have to say, this dude, my God, for retirement, 
I think he's still going to sneak on and do something. He's going to pop on the screen. He got a movie or something coming out, right? That's what you got to be doing, something. <laughs> this is like, this is unprecedented. I don't know anyone that's, you know, as as awesome in their afterglow as this gentleman is in his so-called, uh, or uh, not even off-season, you know, retirement. So I would be looking forward to seeing great things still coming from you, <laughs> and I'm not surprised when they surface, should they surface anytime soon. For me, my main thing is I'm still trying to train with the guys, and, you know, I'm trying to hang in there a little bit, and, you know, that's just the outcome of it. But now nah, I'm retired, and I won't ever compete, and I'm not even planning on doing something. I'm not even planning on taking off my clothes unless a guy like Kai Green, you know, calls me out in public. Yes, <laughs> yes I've learned my lesson. I've learned a lesson. If I ever try to do that again, I will just be very, very prepared for the unexpected with this dude. For the Predator Kai Green, I'm Dennis James for FlexOnline.com. <laughs>